Welcome back. Tonight we're going to share an incredible story about a boy and his dog. It's a story about adversity, difficult decisions, and it's a story about a kid willing to take a monumental loss just to move forward. Mike Hedrick has the story. I like racing because it's full of action and never runs out of it. It's just 14 years old. And when they come out of that turn, they'll get up to racing speed. Travis Carpenter sometimes needs a little nudge when making difficult decisions. How is the car doing? Two clicks. Up here on the deck, he's actually the crew chief in training. He decides speed. He decides risk. Right now we are in fifth. And he decides strategy. How long have you been into that? Probably my entire life so far. But the biggest decision this kid has ever made has nothing to do with racing. It was a decision that's got everything to do Walk down there. Yeah. with the one thing missing in his life. It's been really hard. I don't even know how I would handle it. How am I to teach my kid how to handle this? That's Travis's mom, Kelly. It was just a short while ago her son had two full functioning legs. But one of those legs... Travis has neurofibromatosis. ...was not functioning as well. It's a genetic condition affecting one in 3,000, and it causes tumors to form on nerves anywhere throughout the body. And for Travis, the nerves affected were located on his left leg. What you're looking at here is an MRI taken not too long ago. And just about every white spot on that photo... I looked at it and I was like, yeah... ...is a tumor. There's a whole bunch on one side that's not on the other. There was literally almost no muscle. That's Kevin Jones, Travis's doctor for the past decade or so. And because of those tumors... He just had such weakness in the bone that it just kind of gave up. Travis broke his leg once. He broke it twice. And after break number three, we fixed his bone with a rod. Travis's leg was so consumed by tumors, the bone stopped growing, the muscle got weaker, and life-altering decisions had to be made. Travis, this is not working well for you. And if, at some point in the future, you want to talk to me about other options, I'm happy to talk about that. Other options. So, Maybe, come here. as Travis was left to think about those other options... And see this happy, happy dog just living life to the fullest. Yeah, the family invested in a little, well, let's just call this puppy therapy. This, my friends, is Lady. Lady, look. An Entel Butcher mountain dog. Lady, come here. Part brown, part black, part white, and all puppy. It was a really good bright spot for all of us. Walk it, lady. All right, now a couple of things you should know about this boy and his really fun bright spot. Good girl. Travis likes high fives. High five. Lady likes high fours. Good girl. And the best part is Lady is doing every little bit of it. Right, lady, fetch. Minus her one front leg. She has a deformed limb. They think it was just something that happened in the wound. Now in the dog world, Lady is lovingly referred to as a tripod. Just look at her go there. Probably doesn't even know she is missing a limb. And probably doesn't know... So she motivated you. ...the nudge she was giving to Travis. When I saw her get around, eat really well, I'm like, maybe I should do that so I can get around better than I am right now. So, on April 29th, 2021, Travis had his legs surgically removed. It's still tough, and you still just... You still just cry. And what he lost that day is not easy to put into words. It was a very difficult decision because you can never get your leg back if you get rid of it. But despite the reality, Travis will be the first to tell you the trade-off. You're doing great. Oh, that trade-off was an entirely new life. He began doing things. He began experiencing things. Yeah, I'm a pretty good driver. He began pushing towards a future in things he never thought possible. And I just wanted to get rid of it so I can go out, have fun, and... Go push harder than I ever have before. And pushing right beside him. Good girl. She seems to know. He's a little different. I'm a little different. Is his three-legged dog. Now, Travis and those around him will tell you, even without Lady... He just needed a little nudge. He didn't need a big nudge. He eventually would have made the decision to amputate. But sometimes in life, when making difficult decisions... I think it's really cool that I have a dog that's... Just like me. Every single one of us needs. We all need something to sort of give us that taste of courage. Good girl. A little nudge. Good girl. Now can you... 